back to Beta of Africa and today we're going to be doing a very special video and that is we're going to be showing you a chef which was in touch with us since a restaurant we had a restaurant since that time and up to now he's in touch with us so he came to the Easter holiday place uh, if you didn't see the Easter holiday videos they are part one and part two please go and check it out but first let's finish this video and it's about him making a yummy paratha and beef can you believe he's a ugandan african he's making a kerala food let's go and see how it's done so paratha and beef is like Keralian kind of food and my mom loves it she loves beef a lot like better than chicken and all she doesn't like chicken too much she only likes beef a lot so he's so mad at beef and also paratha paratha and beef yummy Ah, all that will come to me. So if you guys want to see how it's done, please don't forget to, like, without skipping this video, you have to see it till the end. And after the video, like, share, and subscribe. Yeah. So right now, the handsome man from beautiful Africa, as our channel's name is Beauties of Africa, well, we're just calling ourselves beautiful, I feel. So then we're gonna see how it's done and we enjoyed it, it was chili pilly, it was spicy and you know mostly Ugandans don't like spicy stuff, they eat salty stuff. Even last time we went to a like a uh, local place and there was uh, some rice and curry, it was not very like spicy at all. For us we like spicy food, so let's go and see how it's done! So guys, this is Ronald and he's making paratha with azam, sugar, egg, oil, salt and he's making the paratha. I can't wait to eat it. And guys, he's making the paratha and we had a restaurant and he was the chef. It was an Indian restaurant. He used to make all the Indian food and stuff. He knows almost every Indian food. And Porota is a Carolan food. Oh wow, well, look at the parotta. It's ready. It's very yummy. Yeah, look at the crispiness and how it's so pretty. I love it. Can't wait to eat it. He has made a lot of parotta. He still has remaining. So yeah, let's see the rest. So guys, the parotta is ready and now he's gonna make beef fry. So the stuff we need are onions, green chili, ginger garlic, and curry leaves. Yeah, so let's see how the beef is done. Ooh, it looks so yummy! After boiling the beef, he put some oil and waited for it to be hot. Then he put some jeera, then he started the beef, uh, like the onions the curry leaves and everything now he's putting the ginger garlic then the onions and after that he's i mean it's coconuts not onions i had a little mistake in that he mixed it well then he put some onions in it yeah guys then he added some green chili and some curry leaves and he sorted very well. Now he's adding some turmeric powder and some coriander masala, chili powder, black pepper powder, and he's gonna mix it so well after that. That's the most satisfying part, guys. 
He sorted so well till the rose smell went. So yeah, he's sorting it so well. He's mixing it, and when you look at the color, it's so satisfying to me. And then he's adding the beef, and he's gonna mix it up. And I think I don't know what he's going to do next, but let's see. So guys, finally the beef fry is ready. Ooh, so yummy. My dad is gonna taste it and it was so yummy. That's what he said. We enjoyed it so much. It was a good and a happy meal. It was so good, guys. Yummy. This is an amazing African guy who made an amazing Caroline food which it tastes chili pili was so yummy it was spicy the spice was in correct order and hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you liked it please don't forget to like share and subscribe bye, -bye.